Now we're looking at our third note. This is G. G is on the second line of the staff. And we finger G by putting our thumb between the first two valves on the back, our pinky on top of the pinky ring, and our fingers just touch the top of the valves. Because it's, it's what we call open, no valves pressed. And that G sounds like this. Try that with me. Ready? And. Try that again. Ready? Now. So also match that sound on your mouthpiece. Now buzz that on your mouthpiece while I play it on the trumpet. Here we go. Ready? Now. To raise this pitch up, I'm pulling the corners of my lips back. I'm tucking the backs of my jaws up against my back teeth. I'm pulling tall here to make the sound, to raise the sound up. Okay, we're going to play this. I'm going to play for four and have you play back four beats. We'll just call and response here. I'll play first. Here we go. One, two, me, first. Play. Three, four. Play. Two, three, four. Play. Two, three, four. Play. Two, three, four. Play. Two. Three, four. All right. Now, now let's try holding that for eight counts. So I'll play for eight counts, and then you play for eight counts. Here we go. One, two, ready, begin. Play. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Play, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Play, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep backing this up and going over it. Do that, hold that out eight on the horn, hold it out eight on, on the mouthpiece. Make sure we have, we're tucking our corners back and that we're not pushing down with the lips. We're creating a flat chin and a high, tall embouchure here. Teeth have to be at least the width of your finger apart for the air to get through. 